Susan, as you mentioned, this is one of many protests that's being held in California and all across the world in response to the war. And everyone here marching in the Pershing Square area today was pro-Palestinian, and it was a very passionate crowd. Flying flags and waving signs, thousands of pro-Palestinian demonstrators gathered in downtown L.A. to demand an end to violence in the Middle East. No matter which way you look at it, it's not right what's going on over there. What do you want to have happen? For the U.S. to stop funding the killing of babies. Yeah. We shouldn't be giving Israel any type of money. They don't need our money. Demonstrators rallied in Pershing Square before marching and driving through the area, opposing the occupation of Gaza and Israeli airstrikes. It's a lot of passion. No, you know, you know, no violence. Everybody just wants peace in the Middle East. Protest observer and TikToker Atif Hashwi is participating in demonstrations on both sides of the conflict. So I think that people at heart, both sides, really do want peace and they want to coexist. You know, have their own country. And here, people just want a free Palestine. And that doesn't mean destruction of Israel or, or something, you know? They have the rights. They have parliament. Tensions rose at times when Israeli supporters approached pro-Palestinian demonstrators. And what I see here in the street is a lot of stupid people that don't really understand what's happening. I think people are fed up of what's happening over there in Palestine, um, but they also want peace and they want uh, like a ceasefire. And last week, as we reported, many of the same people who are out here today uh, gathered near the Israeli consulate in West L.A. Now, tomorrow, there's going to be a pro-Israel fundraiser that's going to be held in Sherman Oaks starting at 4 p.m.